Hey guys, this is Torner and today we're going to be talking about the next patch, the rumors around it and what my predictions are based on those as kind of a final thing um, just before kind of we get the new in Envoy information and before the uh, actual patch comes out, which is meant to be coming this week. So I'm pretty excited because this is another kind of skilletary esque thing where there's characters coming out and we don't exactly know where they're going. I'm not obviously going to be talking about Bishop and Jubilee. We know where they're going. Um, but I am going to be talking about the different reworks that were rumored to be happening and the characters that one was confirmed and what has been rumored. So first of all, White Tiger. So White Tiger and Moon Knight. I am fairly certain that these two are both going to be on the Defenders team and I think that they're both going to be Mystic. I think that they're going to have great synergy alongside Iron Fist to be able to potentially go into the Doom Raids for the, um, like the Mystic area for that where... You can have <laughs> Iron Fist go along with them and spam them for the heals and stuff. And I feel like Moon Knight is definitely going to be a brawler and it wouldn't surprise me if White Tiger was as well. The other thing that could potentially happen would be Moon Knight be Mystic and Skill. Imagine that, like they add in a new character that has two traits similar to how Doctor Doom does, except Moon Knight being incredibly strong in raids as well. Obviously, Doom is great, and he does kind of wreck raids. However, his cooldowns are very long, so having a character with shorter cooldowns who potentially gives, like, his team drain or something like that would be great. Kind of a universal mystic character that has synergy with just different mystic characters. Um, Moon Knight could definitely be there, and it's kind of guaranteed that one or both of these characters are going to have the defenders tag i think it's likely both given the fact that when they announced punisher was going over to the skilletary team they said oh and we have plans for additional defenders in the future so again i'm pretty sure both of these guys are going to be mystic and i'm pretty sure that both of them are going to be on the defenders team however i feel like they're going to be defenders and then there's going to be a new sub category of defenders uh, or some of them will go over there or something like that because based on um kind of the movies that are coming out and stuff they're likely going to be wanting to synergize characters with that there was also the rumor that both daredevil and electra were getting reworked there's potential that kind of the daredevil rework was kind of a he's getting the most rework but the rest of the defenders are getting a minor one and same with electra like she's getting the most rework and then some of the hand are getting reworked so like four other members of the hand are getting reworked um but I feel like they're going to put kind of Daredevil, Elektra, Moon Knight, White Tiger, and then as the last character for now, uh, Psylocke onto the same team into a martial artist team. Uh, we did used to have the martial artist tag and it was originally required for the Psylocke event. And that was kind of the only time that event was at uh, that tag was like ever used. But it wouldn't surprise me if they kind of remove that so they could bring it back. And I think that these Electra, like the Electra, Electra and Daredevil reworks have to be on the same team. It would be really odd if they rework these two just before Valentine's and then all of a sudden, oh, hey, they're going to stay on their own teams. They're not going to have any synergy. I mean, Electra basically has like negative synergy. Well, she, she counters defenders. So it wouldn't surprise me if they kind of rework them together put them into some kind of hodgepodge team similar to Skilletary um, and then call it like martial artist or something. And then later on, we end up getting Shang-Chi for that team because we know that Shang-Chi movie is meant to be coming out. I mean, it, it depends on COVID, but uh, it wouldn't surprise me if Shang-Chi gets put onto that team and becomes like the, the head of the team kind of thing where yeah, the team kind of revolves around him because I mean, they kind of need to have a character that they can uh, ramp up from that movie and Shang-Chi being the main character. It wouldn't surprise me if they kind of had him there. Um, I don't know exactly. Like, it's it's really rough. And um, I actually, these kind of patches where it's like, here's a couple characters that are completely unrelated to a team that's coming. Well, not unrelated. They're not it's it's kind of like we don't know what's happening i mean it's possible that they kind of put both of these guys on the defenders um and then have daredevil come off the team 
and have Daredevil, Elektra kind of have synergy together with some other martial artist, skilletary characters, like skilletary esque kind of thing. Um, there's lots of ways that they can do that. Now, the final kind of rework that has been rumored was Night Nurse, and I'm fairly certain, like I'm about... I'm about 90% certain in this kind of guess is that she's going to be like a universal healer. I feel like she's going to be very tier four heavy. So that way they can kind of still make money off of her because tier fours are kind of a very limited resource. Um, but she's going to be like this universal healer. So that way their skill team can kind of go through it and um because otherwise skill doesn't really have any healers. So having night nurse be that healer, I'm, Pretty, pretty sure that that's going to be what ends up happening and it wouldn't surprise me. So as I said, Night Nurse, Universal Healer, but Tier 4 Heavy. Then you've got Moon Knight and White Tiger, most likely both defenders. However, then Moon Knight comes off to go on to a different team alongside like uh, Daredevil, um, Elektra, and uh and psylocke and then moon knight's the one that kind of ties that together because uh, as we heard the rumor was that he's going to be a milestone character so it wouldn't surprise me if he's kind of like the the head of that team where they kind of all kind of revolve around him he's the one that gives them like i mean imagine ghost rider was a um ghost rider was a milestone character even if we're talking about like the normal milestones he was a milestone character or not the more normal milestone, the character milestones. He was a milestone character and the supernatural team kind of revolves around him. So it wouldn't surprise me if this new martial artist, they probably won't call it martial artist because they might need to re-add martial artists in later on, but it'll be something similar to that. Um, kind of, I, it wouldn't surprise me if that kind of revolves around Moon Knight. Um, I don't know. There's there's a lot of stuff that's kind of up in the air here. So I just wanted to kind of give my thoughts on it before the actual official information comes out. So that way I can be like, hey guys, look, I <laughs> I was successful. Guess this. This is this is complete guesses. The characters are rumored, but where they're actually going is really up in the air. And it's actually really exciting for me. I don't know about you guys, but this this kind of up in the air, what's happening with this team is really exciting for me. Um I really like knowing the characters beforehand because then it lets me speculate on stuff like this. If you guys aren't interested in this kind of speculation stuff though, let me know down in the comments and I can stop it or we can put like do less of it or whatever. But there's a lot of kind of cool stuff that's here. The other thing is that White Tiger um, actually had a lot to do with uh, Daredevil and with Elektra, especially around like the Shadowland um, storyline and stuff. So there's potential that they want to make sure that she's on the same team alongside um, Daredevil and Elektra. So um, she also kind of, I don't, she, she like went around with the hand for a while and stuff like that from memory, or at least she worked with the hand for a little bit in the Shadowlands kind of area. Maybe she was fighting them. I can't remember exactly. Um, but I'd love to hear from you guys what you think. That's it for today. Have a great day and goodbye. <laughs>